Hey guys, Bill the Kansas Flamingo Chef and welcome back to my bar. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make three really easy cocktails with only these four ingredients. So all you need, Kahlua, vodka, get a decent vodka. Don't skimp out and get really bottom shelf stuff. And just like with Kahlua, don't, uh, don't get Kimura or some of that knockoff stuff that says coffee liqueur. It's not going to taste the same. Half and half. This is from the lovely people at Kroger. And Coca-Cola. And yes, you could use Pepsi, although I hate Pepsi. Uh, you could use Diet Coke or uh, Coke Zero. That's fine. I just happen to have this can of Coke. But you know what? Just for the sake of argument, we'll use a Diet Coke. Because I've got some on the bar. All right. So we're going to make three drinks. And it's a build. So you can actually turn one drink into another. If you decide you don't like the flavor of one, you'd like to try something else. So we're going to start with Kahlua. We're going to put an ounce of Kahlua in each glass. So in this jigger, there's actually a one ounce line, makes it a little easier. Now, if you wanted to just have Kahlua on the rocks, I guess actually we could have four different drinks here, or quite frankly, five if you just had straight vodka. So on drink number one, we're going to make a white Russian. So all a white Russian is, is Kahlua with vodka in equal parts. Technically, it should be sent out just like that, but most people are going to stir it which is fine. So we'll go ahead and stir it. It really doesn't make a difference. I happen to be a very big fan of the Black Russian. Up next, the same measurement in all three of these. So we're going to put an ounce of vodka in each one. So now technically we have three Black Russians. There's got to be a joke in there somewhere. But how about if we make one into a white Russian? So all we need is some half and half, about that far. Now let's go ahead and make this one into a white Russian as well. Now we've got a black Russian and two white Russians. If you like a white Russian, you're good to go. I love to send them out looking like this. I don't like them stirred, but most people are going to stir it and turn it into chocolate milk. And that's perfectly fine. It's good too, but I like the other one better. So, what's the last ingredient? What is Coca-Cola for? Well, if you take a white Russian and you add Coca-Cola and you let it separate, it's called a Colorado Bulldog. So, with four ingredients on... I highly recommend you lightly stir this so the cream doesn't curdle. So with four ingredients, Kahlua, vodka, half and half, and some Coke. Got a black Russian, a white Russian, and a Colorado Bulldog. So no matter what your flavor profile, here's a great way to impress your friends. See you next time. Eat fabulous. Subscribe to the channel. Like and share. I'm also on Rumble, YouTube, and of course you can visit me online at KansasFlamingoChef.com.